is up guys welcome to my channel my name is Branka and I'm glad you're here because today it is officially 2024 it is currently January 1st so of course today we have to make our vision board one of the creators I like to watch on this app is Amber Shaw she is like the CEO of vision board so we're going to be making our own this year and I'm super excited so without further ado let's get into making our vision board all you're gonna need for this project is a bristle board which you can get at the dollar store you're gonna need photos which you can print out on your own printer uh if you're in america cvs or if you're in canada staples i've sectioned mine into three different sections i have things i actually want to accomplish a bunch of quotes and just some filler backgrounds that are pretty in blue then you're gonna need some scissors and you're gonna need some tape i am being forced to use duct tape because it was either this or medical tape but uh as you can tell those are from all the christmas wrapping i did and uh yeah i went through a lot of tape i think there's even more than that this is my vision board from last year 2023 i actually did end up accomplishing a lot of the things on my vision board some of them i didn't get to but i can try again this year so here is my 2023 rewind last year i started a youtube channel drove on the highway for the first time ended up attending the university at buffalo i played lots of hockey i got to go to ohio and pittsburgh for hockey games. Overall, it was a really good year and I'm hoping to make my 2024 even better. The dream board is basically your Pinterest board come to life. I use Pinterest to find all of my photos. It's great for finding cute aesthetic photos for your dream board and the secret to dream boards is through the power of manifestation. So manifestation is basically when you believe in something so much that the universe delivers it to you. But this doesn't work unless you take actual steps to towards achieving your goals. So for example, let's say I wanted to run a 5k by the end of the month. So if I sat at home and watched YouTube videos every day and then tried to run the 5k at the end of the month, I'm probably not going to do it. But instead, if I maybe the first week run a mile, then run two miles, then run three miles, then run four miles, and then try the 5k at the end of the month, I wouldn't be able to do it, but somebody else <laughs> might be able to do it. Amber Scholl always starts with a central quote for her vision board. What if it doesn't come true ah uh, but what if it does of course you guys remember that one that's the most iconic one of all then the next year i did live the life you imagined 2018 was go get what you dream of 2019 was become the you of your dreams that was more like a year about self-improvement 2020 to the fullest one of my personal favorites a la fully to insanity which yes is why i have this tattoo <laughs> 2022 was dreamland. Last year's was the French version of Once Upon a Dream. I have dreamed it. Um, this year's quote is this, the time of my life. Here are all of my quotes. Some of them didn't turn out too well in the printing. For my central quote, I am going to be choosing, I am creating the life of my dreams as that is what I want to do this year. This quote will go in the middle of our vision board. A tip I learned from last year was to place your photos down however you'd like on the Bristol board without actually taping them down. This helps you to get placements, know where you need to add like background photos or anything, and it also helps so you're not taping and untaping your photos and risking damaging them in the process. Another thing I did this year was layering photos. Which this is basically my little rough draft. I'm gonna cut some pieces, add in some filler backgrounds. I'm gonna start from that corner and make my way over and hopefully cover the whole thing this time. If not, we can just get it at the bottom like we did last year. I'm officially like halfway through. I've done this whole side in that little corner. I've switched things around, but I added these little butterflies, which are super cute. I wish I printed more. They're adorable. But I am slowly but surely making my way through. This is what it's looking like so far. Bit of a mess. This side's pretty cute. I'm curious as to what this is going to end up like. I'm super excited, though. And let's see the finished product. Drum roll, please. This is my finished vision board for 2024. It's so cute. It turned out so well. I'm in love with it. So obviously I talked about earlier, I decided to like layer the photos 
So I have a background and two little photos on top, which did allow me to get more photos in and I even like cut bigger photos apart. I also, if you can see, this is an Italian sign and this is an Italian sign. They were in the same photo, but I cut those out specifically so that I could use them to hide any little pieces of white that were poking through. Also, another thing I another thing I added this year was these little like gems jewels or whatever liz <laughs> used them to dazzle some shoes at my house and left them here so finders keepers to have that like pop of 3d when you look at it but it's super cute now that you've seen it let me take you on a little tour and show you guys my goals the first thing on my vision board is this little workout photo um maybe i'll work out hopefully i do Mm, who knows <laughs> I have this one because I want to write more I started writing this story that I really like and I would like to finish it last year I just didn't have much time to write so this year I would like to do that underneath we have a picture of blue eye makeup and I want to get better at doing makeup but uh next up we have the Rome Colosseum so obviously i want to go to italy <laughs> and then up here i have a little quote that says your happiness is all that matters um next up we have look how pretty these little math notes are this is how pretty i want my math notes to be except it is never like that um here we have a little youtube logo because i want to get more consistent on youtube and i also want to learn how to edit better <laughs> sorry if this video sucks guys here is just like a whole bunch of different array of items they're all blue and white so added that there's a little airplane because i want to travel there is this little book because i want to read more here is my central quote we have this because I really want to learn how to like properly draw. I can like, I can do like outlines and stuff like from looking at a photo, but I would really like to draw. We also have some fruit because I want to eat healthier. Then here, this is a bullet journal and I've been obsessed with watching people like plan with me bullet journal editions on YouTube for years. And I've tried to I've tried to do one in the past. It did not turn out. So I want to like actually be able to do this maybe next year, but like practice this year and like plan it all out. I have a picture of this bed because I want to wake up early. It goes hand in hand with that one. There's also some more books down here. Um, this is also another photo of Italy. Here we have a blue little like star face acne patch container because I really would like to get rid of my acne. It very much bothers me. Here is some champagne to signify my birthday because I'll be turning 21 this year, which is crazy, but I'll be able to drink in the States, so that'll be fun. We also have this like blue liquid. I have no idea what it, what it. I have no idea what it actually is, but I put this on there so maybe I drink more water. We have another painting and another little quote that says be afraid and do it anyway. And then we have oh, look at these. These are little like bookends from a photo. Uh those are this is little bookend from a photo much like this, but I just cut it out to cover like little mistakes. Um, but the title of the book is In the Land of Believers, so I thought it was fitting. And then we have another and then we have another little bullet journal section. And then this last one is like a computer setup. Um, this is both for materialistic reason, because I really would like a computer. Um <laughs> Not like a laptop, but like an actual like desktop. I really would like a Mac monitor. So hopefully we get that. And also because I want to have my own like 
desk area to do like homework and like filming or like edit and edit these videos and just like have all like my craft supplies uh but then I also have this on here to signify editing because I really need to figure that out and get better at it <laughs> look at me in my little vision board it's so cute but thank you guys so much for watching this video if you've made it this far you're definitely a trooper I really appreciate it if you enjoyed this video please leave a comment down below if you didn't enjoy the video feel free to leave a hate comment down below I'd love to hear your opinion um let me know what you guys thought about the editing in this video one of the things on my vision board was to get better at editing so let me know what you thought of the edits I tried to do they took me all day which is crazy i wanted to post this video this morning and it was not happening because i could not figure out how to edit but let me know what you guys thought about it thanks for watching and i hope you join me on my journey of becoming 21. <laughs>